Hello Dodgeball fans, this is our final regular season list of the year. Let's see who made a splash heading into Nationals. Taking us off at number 10 is Jack Price of Central Michigan, who takes flight here with a suicide kill to close out a point against Bowling Green at the Grand Valley Gauntlet. Number 9 is courtesy of Cameron Kruger of Kent State as he charges forward against Akron and makes a great catch off the side of his leg here. Number 8 is a team effort from the Falcons of Bowling Green as they cap off their trip to Allendale with a big win over Cincinnati in overtime. At number 7 is Central Michigan's Aaron Morellas as he takes out two Lakers at once with this rare double catch in the corner. Team throw! Was that a double catch? That is a double catch in the corner and we got it on film. Let's go! What a catch. Na -na 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 -na. Jay Oldenburg catches this ball from hard-throwing Alder Grohaska off his face to keep Kent alive against the Buckeyes as they were able to take this point before the half. Unfortunately for the Golden Flashes, they would fall short 3-1. If you blink, you might miss our number 5 play from Nick Foss here, who leans over the throw line to attempt to catch before falling out of bounds. You be the judge. Should this one count? Well, I'm going to go say Oh, what a catch! Oh my gosh! Wow. Oh my god, that was almost unbelievable! Wow! LJ Jones checks in at number four with a catch and kill combo here to secure an overtime victory for the Cavaliers against East Coast rival Maryland. Let's listen to Shadid Drake for it on the call. Oh, he could not snag it! Oh, he couldn't snag it! And it's over! UVA wins! Wow! Kicking off the top three is Jared Householder, who sparks a rally down one players to five against Penn State. Thanks to his efforts, the Dukes are able to secure point one against the Nittany Lions en route to winning the inaugural East Coast Dodgeball Cup. I'm back! That's, that's ground! That's ground! Now it's up to Joey. Here's the team throw. There it is. There it is. Doesn't get more electric than our number two play, which features a one-on-one -on -one in overtime. After two initial throws collide, Akron's Carter Crawford is able to gather himself and secure the win for the Zips, extending their home winning streak and defending their turf at the war. Top play for March features Hunter Stewart being ultra aggressive on this Trent Schaefer throw as he jumps in front of a teammate to secure this catch. Even Schaefer himself had to tip the cap on this one. Oh, oh yes, he's still in! God, he earned that. Oh my God. He, he earned that. And that'll do it for our top plays from March 2024. Please be sure to like and subscribe and be on the lookout for all of our nationals and postseason content as well. I'm Tony Stumbo. Thanks for watching.